To preserve mangroves, one of the planet's most vital ecosystems, UNESCO launched the Mangroves Project in September 2022. Since then, significant progress has been made thanks to the collaborative work between biosphere reserves, government representatives and scientists in understanding the current state of mangroves in seven biosphere reserves in Latin America and the Caribbean. I am Yasmin Ceballos Montemilla, Belgian Ecuadorian trainee, and thanks to the Flores Renation Program, I'm giving general support into the Mangroves Project here at the UNESCO headquarters in Paris. Today, I'm giving you some updates on the advances and challenges of our project. Since the beginning, key face-to-face -face meetings have taken place, such as a project launch at La Encrucijada Biosphere Reserve in Mexico, and scientific meetings at flagship sites such as the Seaflower Biosphere Reserve in Colombia and the Trifinio Fraternidad Transboundary Biosphere Reserve in Honduras. The different stakeholders have worked together to collect data to create a solid baseline on Biosphere Reserve mangroves to ensure successful restoration. Implementation in the Biosphere Reserves is now progressing in multiple countries, including Colombia, Cuba, Ecuador, Mexico and Peru. The project provided opportunities for young scientists to contribute to mangrove conservation. To get everyone on board, the project includes various communication and awareness raising activities, like the production of educational and audiovisual materials, and the organization of advocacy campaigns for the International Day for the Conservation of the Mangrove Ecosystem. The Mangroves Project is a reminder of the importance of global collaboration and commitment to the conservation of our planet. Join us in fostering resilience, biodiversity and sustainable livelihoods. Together, we can make a difference.